now that we know there is entry, there is take profit, and there is stop loss, now we need to know how to actually enter into the market and the different ways to enter into the market. Orders, entries, and exits. These are the ways we'll be learning the different ways to go into the market and how to go out of the markets. An order is an offer you send to your broker using a trading platform like MetaTrader 4 to open or close a transaction. When some specific conditions are met, and this will in turn activate a trade for you, you can simply say an order is how you will enter or exit a trade. You know, I told you earlier on, your enterprise will take you in, your take profit will take you out. Your stop loss will also take you out, but in loss. Your take profit will take you out, but in profit. So now an order is how you want to tell your trading app that, okay, this is how I want you to enter into the market. So let's go into other types. Others fall into two categories. The first category is called market execution. An order instantly executed against the current market price on your trading platform. Okay, let's say I just tell you now, buy USDCAD. That is the market execution. You are buying USDCAD. You can see it over here, market order. This is buy, this is sell. Instant buy and instant sell. Instant execution is the same thing as market execution, okay? An order instantly executed against the current market price. That means you are going in at the current market price. You don't want to know anything. You are just going in at the current market price due to your trade idea or some analysis you did on your own or that has been given to you by a trusted source. All right, let's go on. So the second category is pending orders. An order to be executed later on when the market price reaches a specific price of your choice. The basic orders you need are market execution, stop orders, and limit orders. Any pending order is an order to be executed later, later on when the market price reaches a specific price of your choice. This means, see this blue dot here, you are going for a buy stop. This is where the market price is right now, this blue dot. Then you can see the arrow pointing up. When we set a buy stop and we put our entry price here, the price is still here, but we go into the MetaTrader 4 app, then we select buy stop. We put our entry price here. That means we are telling MetaTrader 4 that whenever the price gets to this place, start buying for me. Whenever the market gets to this place, the price gets to this place, start buying for me. This is where the price is right now, this blue dot. Then whenever the price gets to this point, start buying for me. Then it starts buying. It starts buying. You have set your TP. When it gets to your TP, it will take you out. You have set your stop loss. When it gets to your stop loss, it will take you out. So now you understand orders. That is a buy stop order. That is a buy stop order that when it gets to this particular price, buy it for me. Then let's look at limit orders. As you can see here, we said the basic orders you will need are market execution. That is instant buy and sell. Then stop orders, buy stop, sell stop. And limit orders. These are limit orders. Limit orders. Example of a limit order is you can see this blue dot right here for a buy limit. The price is here above the market price we want to enter the market. We want to buy, but the market price is there. So we want to wait. We said the other that wait for the market price to go down to this particular point. Limit. It has tested these limits. Then bounce off these limits and start buying for me. Then when it gets to this place, the top of the arrow, take profit for me. In case you enter at this place and the market is, keeps going down, when it gets to this place, stop me out in loss. So that is limit orders. So now we understand market execution, stop orders, and limit orders. Both of them are known as pending orders. So now we understand market execution, buy stop, sell stop, buy limit, sell limit. We understand those are the ways to enter into the market. Market execution activates instant and instant position. As I said earlier on, it activates an instant position for you in the market. Buy stop will open a buy position at the price higher than the current price, market price. You can see this is buy stop, this is market price. When it gets to this point, it will open a position for you and keep buying. Sell stop will open 
a sell position at a price lower than the current market price. This is sell stop. This is the current, the blue dot is the current market price. Then when it drops to this point, it sells for you, it plays a sell order for you instantly and starts selling on your behalf. That is a sell stop order. Then we have buy limits. Buy limit, we open a buy position at this price lower than the current market price. This is buy limit here. You can set the buy position here lower than the current market price. When it gets to this market price, it will start buying back again and take you into profit. Then sell limit, we open a sell position at a price higher than the current market price. See, this is the current market price. When the market price goes to this point and can no longer go again, it has a limit. It has its a resistance. Then it will start selling at the bounce. Limit orders, they sell and buy pounds. And stop orders, buy and sell breaks. You can see it's breaking through. Stop orders, buy and sell breaks. Limit orders, buy and sell bounce. 